Hey guys, what's going on? It's Dave. This is GVA, Ghetto Van Adventures. And uh, Wayne uh, from Nomadic Van Man, I'll put his link down below. He asked a question. He was live the other day. I just popped in to show my support. Um, he asked me a question how I stay warm when it's ultra, ultra cold. And I told him, a hot water bottle. <laughs> now this is my backup one. I'll take it out. Now, I'm just going to read a couple things that are on the back here. It says, remove stopper, blah, blah, blah. Only use uh, warm tap water below 50 degrees Celsius. Uh, fill the bottle three-quarter full. Never use hot or boiling water. Okay, I guess I can damage it. Don't use it in a microwave or oven. So what I usually do is I take uh, water. I uh, just bring it so it's steaming. Not boiling, but steaming. You know, pretty warm. And I put in about three-quarters full. And it's a nice thing. I use two of them at night. I use two. I use one down by my feet and one usually at my back or I might hug it depending on how cold it is. But I'm telling you, two hot water balls and they last me the whole night. They do. So I'm just going to open this. Right, get over like this. I know I shouldn't be using my teeth. That's it. That is a hot water bottle. Okay, um, it's got the screw in cap. So literally you just take this out and I, I get a little more expensive ones. There are cheaper ones, but I find they don't last as long. Um, so I, I, I'll spend a little bit of money on them and they last me like a hot water bottle will last me a whole season. I usually chuck them in the summertime and get new ones because I don't want to have them leak on me. But Put the water in there, you fill it up about three quarters full. You put the cap back in and you tighten it up. Put the cap in like that, okay? Oh, that's the cap. Put the cap in, tighten it up. And uh, and you know where I got this idea from? And you make sure it's tight. Three And I'm serious, it's nice. Even, even when it's cold, like just cold and I'm sitting, like say I stop and I just want to have a little nap. I pull out my pillow. <laughs> It's too far back there. Pull up my pillow, put it down, and I'll have a little nap, right? I'll sometimes warm this up and just, just put it on my chest, and it's nice. Now, you're going to laugh. This thing here, this thing here, um, my mother, okay, she was, she had me late in life. I was kind of the surprise. <laughs> she swore by this. She went to bed with a hot water bottle every night in the wintertime, every night, um, and I think that's where I got the idea. She used to give me these things the odd time and I'm going, what do I want that for? And then, you know, I was out in the road and I'm in my van. And I'm going, you know what? A hot water bottle would be good. I did one up and I haven't stopped. I absolutely love these things. So even if you're at home and you need something to keep you warm, hot water bottle, you know, get a good one, follow the directions on the back, like follow the directions. And... I'm, I'm serious. It'll it'll change the way you sleep. You will sleep so comfortable. Uh, these things in the winter have become a lifesaver. Seriously, like minus 30, minus 40 degrees. Anyway, guys, that's about it. Uh, again, go check out uh, Wayne, Nomadic Van Man. Again, I'll put his link down below. Great channel. He's a really nice guy. Grab a hot water bottle. Even if you're at not in a van, but you're at home, grab a hot water bottle and try it. And let me know what you think because these things are wonderful. <laughs> anyway guys you have a great day take care be safe on the road